Good morning, precious. Oh, I guess you're either busy or sleeping, so I'm going back to sleep. I love you. What? I woke up and I missed you. Um, what are you doing? Not much. Oh, I wish you were laying here next to me. I would be able to kiss your beautiful face. I'm not beautiful. Yes, you are, and the goddess. There's nobody in the world that can make my heart relax like you and your beauty. I can't wait to wake up to you every morning, precious. <laughs> For me, uh, yeah, that's heaven. Did you work tonight? Oh yeah, you've been so relaxed. No, I didn't. I want to get unrelaxed when people try to steal you away from me and you don't back them away. I love that they find you attractive, but... I hate that just because you are beautiful, that's a sign for them to make a move on you. You should stop saying cheesy shit you hear in movies and songs when it doesn't match how you actually act or feel. I don't, I don't remember the last time I watched a movie, honey. The way I feel about you is beyond describing. I don't know, I get upset about things that maybe I shouldn't, but... I just want people to stop hitting on you constantly. They can find their own perfect match. More cheesy BS. I don't know who you are trying to convince. Me. Or yourself. If I said cheesy shit from a movie, honey, it would be, um... You had me from hello. You might as well say that. It's better than you're so special because of the way you are. I asked you to marry me. There's nothing cheesy about that. We both already know that we had each other at low. That was never hard to see. What world are you living in? No, we didn't. Oh, you must have fallen asleep. Mm, I love you, Richard. Mm, good night. I responded, but all right. Nothing came true till now. Right. And we did have each other at low the second time around. The first time we didn't like each other. The it wasn't at hello. It's probably this storm that's coming that's messing up the service. They're supposed to be getting two feet of snow in from Pennsylvania, from what it said on the news. You sure love the weather. Mm, I have to pay attention to it, so that I know what I'm able to do the following day. But yeah, mm, I'm a little fascinated by it. The important thing to me is that we have each other now, and I never want to let you go. That's why I get so upset when you say no to marry me. It's going to be cold, snowy, windy today, so I thought about working on our bathroom and your closet. Or maybe the stone wall. Which one do you want me to work on first? I guess my angel fell asleep. Mm, I love you, precious. I sure didn't. No, mm, oh, okay. Did you read my previous message? I think the storm is screwing with the delivery of your messages. Oh, you fell asleep. Yeah, I read it. Oh, you fell asleep. I said I read it. Yeah, the storm is messing with the delivery of your messages. Which one would you like me to work on today? I don't care. Okay, I was just trying to include you, but I guess I'll decide when I get to it. It's supposed to start snowing here around 6 a.m. I've had to reboot my phone three times just to get those messages to send. Well, maybe that's a sign to stop messaging. Are you going to sleep now? Or is that a hint for me to stop so you can go to sleep? Lol. Good night, precious. I love you. Neither. You're not tired yet? No. Did you take a nap yesterday that is making you stay awake longer this morning? No. What's making you so alert? I put my phone in your closet window so your messages will come through better and mine will send better. Nothing. Mm, are you naked? No. Do you want to get naked with me? No. Wow. I didn't expect that. Have you already been naked tonight? No. What kind of question is that? I just thought you might have masturbated while I was asleep. No. Hmm. Sometimes I wish you could read my thoughts. Why is that? Because sometimes I get overwhelmed with the way I feel about you. And sometimes it's a really sad feeling that you're not here yet. And sometimes it's a feeling that makes me just smile out of nowhere. I am really so in love with you. And can't picture being without you. What movie did you hear all that from? I didn't. I'm giving you my true feelings, honey. You shouldn't question them. My heart is all yours. Weird way to feel about someone you broke up with. <sighs> you already know that I don't want us to be broken up. I'm trying my ass off to get you to say yes. I never want us to be this way again. I'd ask you again right now to marry me, but I don't want to do it over text. 
Would you share your thoughts with me? Apparently not. Did you fall asleep? I guess you fell asleep this time. Mm, I love you, precious. Sleep tight, my love. Good morning, precious. I can't believe that I just woke up again. Closed my eyes when you fell asleep and thought that I would sleep for one hour. I slept for another four hours. I obviously need to sleep. It sucks that I woke up with a headache, though. I wish I could wake up to your beautiful face next to me this morning. It still hasn't started snowing yet. Honestly, it wouldn't hurt my feelings if it didn't snow here. Crap. It just started snowing, honey. Just got out of the shower, honey. The whole time I was in there, I couldn't stop thinking about how perfect and beautiful you are to me. And for me. You're 110% my angel. And I love you. Honey, I guess I'm going to work out in the shed today and do what I can to make it warm out there for Roy. I have a good idea how to make it so it will hold the heat for a long time. Oh, but it will work. Holy crap, honey. I just watched the 12 o'clock news and parts of New York have gotten over four feet of snow. I'm done working on Roy's living quarters for today. He's staying at mom's again tonight, so I'm going to do more work on it tomorrow while he's not here. And you'll be on beautiful. Somewhere out there Beneath the pale moonlight Someone's thinking of me And loving me tonight Somewhere out there Someone saying a prayer that we'll find one another in that big somewhere out there. And even though I know how very far apart we are, it helps to think we might be wishing on the same bright star. And when the night wind starts to sing a lonesome lullaby, it helps to think we're sleeping underneath the same big sky. Somewhere out there, if love can see us through, then we'll be together somewhere out there, out where dreams come true. Voicemail pressures. Hmm. Why does something feel odd to me? Yellow. Hi. Are you okay? Yellow. Uh -huh. I'm fine. Okay. Hi, Lord. Hi, honey. I was feeling a little odd for a minute there because you hadn't answered yet. And you right. hadn't messaged me all because you hadn't answered me yet. And you hadn't Hello. messaged me all day. Huh? Bonjour. Bonjour. Where's all where's all the French talk coming from? Huh? Honey. What are you doing? Je suis un écureuil. Huh? You're talking French. We. Oui. Why are you talking French? Porque. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Is that Spanish? That's Spanish. <laughs> Why are you Chef talking Jeff French? Jeff is teaching me. Oh, goody. That's why I haven't heard from you all day. You spent the day with Chef Jeff. 
That's a thrill. A thrill. Oh, yeah. It was fun. Well, I'm spending a lot of time with Chef Jeff, aren't you? Chef Jeff gets all your attention during the day, and I get fucking nothing. Not a fucking thing. Again, this makes time number two. Chef Jeff must be a hell of a guy. And have all kinds of fun with fucking Chef Jeff, but you can't have a fucking bit of fucking fun or time with me because of... You cut out. So that must be why it took you so long to answer my calls this time, because you were fucking spending time with Chef Jeff all day. Am I wrong? Not really. No. Nice to know that you're spending all kinds of time with another guy. All kinds of time. Not the first time. You cooked Italian the sausage day. with him. The whole time you've been awake? No. No? What time did you wake up? Well, I went to bed at 5 a.m. Okay, you stopped talking to me at 4.36. Is there someone no, else wait. you said goodnight to? It was 5.30. It was 5.30, so was there somebody else that you said goodnight to? What? Was there somebody else that you said goodnight to? Oh, stop being silly. No. I want to know, Jamie. You went to bed at 5.30. You, you stopped talking to me at 4.36 my time. So there's two hours. Who would you spend that two hours with? Because you ignored me for a long time. Who would you spend the two hours with, Jamie? Yeah. So I sent you a message all the way up to almost 5 o'clock. So who'd you spend all that time with? No one. No one. What time did you wake up? I don't remember. How much time did you spend with Chef Jeff today? Oh, I don't know. Maybe a couple hours. A couple fucking hours. I've been sending you messages. You couldn't fucking send me one fucking message. And when I called you, that's who you were talking to, wasn't it? It was Chef Jeff. I'm talking to you now. That's who you were talking to, was Chef Jeff, wasn't it? What? That's who you were talking to, was Chef Jeff, when I called, right? That's why it took you so long to answer the phone. Get off my balls, bro. No, um, oh fucking shit! You fucking ditch me for Chef Jeff. Go right ahead. I didn't. What? What the fuck is going on, with this goddamn Chef boy? I bitch. You're fucking doing <laughs> something, Jamie. You're fucking bullshitting me. What? What's going on with him? You're spending all your fucking time with this cocksucker. Ignoring me and spending all your fucking time with this cocksucking chef boy, I bitch. Who is this fucking guy, Jamie? Nothing bro, chill out. Bullshit. Is he the reason that you mentioned to me that you think we ought to fucking date different people and go out and fuck? Is he the fucking one? Fuck off upstairs. You haven't even, he's the one that fucking talks you that! You fucking asshole! Fuck that fucking piece of shit! I can't believe you're fucking repeating shit from that car sucker to me! And you go right back and start fucking talking to him when I hang up! Instead of fucking calling me back, you so I mean so much to you.
you, don't I, Jamie? Because this cocksucker seems like he means an awful lot to you. Bonjour. Bonjour. I hung up, but you always fucking call me back. Um. You don't go off talking to that fucking piece of shit. Don't make his sticking fucking bonjour up his fucking ass. Um. Don't take his Italian sauces and stick it up his own ass. Isn't that funny how he wanted to teach you how to make Italian sausage? Because it looks like a big fucking cock. So isn't that fucking funny? What a coincidence. Like I'm fucking stupid, right, Jamie? Roger, is that what you said? What's going on with him, Jamie? Hello. You're spending all fucking day with him and ignoring me. All day. Yeah. Whatever fucking time you woke up, how long did you spend a couple hours with him? You didn't go to bed till 5.30 your time, which means 4.30 my time, you stopped talking to me. So you spent two hours with somebody else. And it was probably that fucking cocksucker. But then when you woke up, you didn't say a fucking word to me. But you spent a couple hours with that motherfucker. What's going on with this cocksucker, Jamie? Because you're spending an awful lot of time with him. What? Who is cocksucker? That fucking cocksucking chef boy, a bitch face. You seem to be His talking to him Jeffrey. every fucking day. Every fucking day you're talking to him, Jamie. His name is Jeffrey. His name is fucking cocksucker. Excuse you. I don't fucking excuse me. There's no goddamn internet piece of shit. So when I hung up, did you call Jeffrey? The He's cocksucker? Nice He's a fucking cocksucker. Don't try to fucking pull the wool over my eyes when he's trying to teach you how to make I Italian sausage cause you, and you handle it so well and you're good. Well, said it was good. Yeah, well, cocksucker told you you handled it well. Go fucking figure. And? And? Like there's no, no pun in there? Like, I'm fucking stupid and can't figure that shit out. There wasn't a pun. Bullshit. Why are you spending so much fucking time with this guy, Jamie? I'm not. You, you spend a fucking couple hours with him today. It's more time than you spend with me. And you fucking look at the other, the other day. Yesterday you fucking talked to him. When? The day before that. The day before that. And you fucking spent time with somebody this morning after you were done talking to me. Jeffrey yesterday. Just fucking yes, you told me yesterday that you talked to Jeffrey. When? You talked, you said, Jeffrey, I talked to Jeffrey today. That's what you said yesterday. Okay. <laughs> it's fucking bullshit. It's fucking bullshit, Jamie. No. You're spending all, all this fucking time you're spending with these fucking people, and you're not giving me shit for fucking time unless you're bitching me out. No. Yeah. You wonder why I get pissed and fucking yell? My fucking heart is involved in you completely. I don't give a I don't give a fuck about Jeffrey and his fucking French sausages. Friend. 
huge. I don't give a fuck about the bitch at the bar with a fucking sending tits. I don't give a fuck about Rod and Todd. Alex. Yeah, Alex. She's sweet. Oh, of course she is. She sends you fucking pictures of her tits. Fucking Jeffrey is sweet, too. Shows you how to make Italian sausage. Very first thing he shows you how to make fucking sausage. What a coincidence. Sausage is shaped like a big fucking cock. What a coincidence. Yet it was easy to make. Of course it was. And you handled it well. Yeah, and Ron and Todd, Ron and Todd were fucking friends. Well, lo and behold, fucking Ron sends you a business fucking deal. Then Todd wants to get involved. He did. It What's was the, a lot of money. Hey, yeah, you fucked him already, right? You just said it was a lot of money. What's wrong with a business deal? Did you fuck him already, Jamie? No. Well, why did you say was? Not yet. Yeah, not yet. Of course you're gonna. The fucking... This fucking cocksucker... Keffrey... The fuck is up with you spending so much time with him? It's and fucking ship for time. Pizza. And ship and ship for time with me. It's a lot not of even a, Not even a fucking message to me today, but hours with Jeffrey. But nothing's going on there, right? Then you leave me at fucking four thirty my time this morning, which is three thirty your time. You don't go to bed till fucking 5.30 your time. So who was that time spent with, Jamie? Because it wasn't me. Today. No, you didn't. Sorry. Oh, yeah. You sound real sorry. I'm glad I crossed your mind. I'm glad I mean so much to you, Jamie. That really fucking... Helps our fucking relationship a lot. When you don't spend shit for time with me, not send me shit for fucking messages, but you spend hours with a cocksucker Jeffrey. Didn't I text you at 3 a.m.? Jamie, give me a fucking break. That's today. That was this morning. You've been awake since then. I guess and I I've texted, texted you. you. I've texted you all day long, fucking throughout the day. Throughout the fucking day, and you ignored my fucking text, Jamie. Because you were spending time with this cocksucker, Jeffrey. Then you didn't call me back as you, what, you're spending time with Jeffrey again? Instead of calling me back... I guess I but I'm the one. Today, I I am the one that's doing everything wrong, right, Jamie? I guess I texted you today, then. No, no, you didn't. That fucking counted as yesterday when you hadn't even gone to sleep yet. PM. I don't give a fuck, Jamie. Say what you want to say. You didn't fucking. You haven't texted me all day long when I was texting you. But you spend time with Jeffrey, hours with Jeffrey, no fucking messages to me, nothing. You probably haven't even listened to your voicemail, have you? Know why? Because I must not mean shit to you. But Jeffrey sure does. It's important to spend time with Jeffrey. He's teaching me French and how to make sausages that look like big cocks. 
According to the world clock, it was the 17th of December, which is today. <laughs> this fucking horseshit, Jamie. I guess I texted you today. No, you didn't. According to the not world since we, clock, not, it was the not since we've been. December, which is today. When you I stop talking to me. Today. When you stop talking to me this morning, who was it you spent them two hours with? Asked and answered. No. Asked and not answered. So why don't you answer it, Jamie? I answered 87. No, you didn't, 87. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. And you spent hours with Jeffrey. Can't forget Jeffrey. Jeffrey is very important. So did you spend time with him on the phone? Or did you spend time with him on the computer? Who did you spend on your webcam? time after I stopped texting on, you? I went to fucking sleep. You've got it right on your fucking phone that I was texting you when I woke up. So how many times have you webcammed with Jeffrey? Why would you call me 87? How dare you? Well, how dare you? You're the one that's fucking dicking around all these other fucking guys. Lorne. How many times have you webcammed with Jeffrey? Lorne. What? Are you listening? I'm trying, Jamie. But you're making it awful fucking hard because the shit Listen. you do. Are you listening? I'm trying. I want a yes. Yes, Are I'm listening. listening. Yes. Fuck off upstairs. Fuck you, Jeffrey. Thanks for treating me like nothing, so you can spend time with your chef boy a bitch. Just friends with him, right, Jamie? Fucking horseshit. Fucking lie. Guess now we know who you've been spending all your time with, why you've been acting the fucked up way you've been. What? Right back to fucking talking to Jeffrey, didn't ya? You got that fucking computer on, that webcam on, and the microphone on, so that you could say... Your little fucking Jeffrey phrase. So that Jeffrey could hear you. Trying to impress what? Jeffrey, aren't you? Trying to impress Jeffrey, aren't you? That's what you fucking did right there, wasn't it? You got Jeffrey on the fucking computer so he can hear your conversation. And you said his little fucking phrase to me so you could try to impress him. Isn't that right, Jamie? What makes you think that? Jamie, you never would have fucking said that otherwise. Especially to make sure that I was fucking said yes before you fucking said that bullshit. Too stupid. You're a fucking cheater, Jamie. You don't want fucking me? You no, want that fucking cocksucker? You go fucking get him! Him no, and his no. fucking Italian sausage! You're fucking cheating on me! You're fucking cheating on me, Jamie! Fuck you! You want the fucking cocksucker? Go fucking get him, Jeffrey lover. Fucking cheater. It used to be you would call me back and get a straight note. Now your face is burning the fucking computer for the chef boy, I'll fucking bitch. Makes me want to fucking puke. You're ruining us with that fucking pizza fucking shit. Yeah, you really give a fuck about us. That fucking computer is more important to you. That's the reason you've been saying no to marrying me. Because you're chef boy, I'll bitch. I'm not playing your hang up game. Are you gonna call back or can I go do something? What? If you're not going to play my hang-up game, you better stop hanging up on me, too. 
This the fucking bull. Tonight. This fucking bullshit with this fucking cunt hole Jeffrey. Better fucking stop, Jamie. You're I fucking ignoring me. Tonight. You're ignoring me to spend hours with this motherfucker. You completely fucking ignored me today. How the fuck do you think that makes me feel? I like you don't give a tonight. fuck about me, but this fucking cunt old Jeffrey. Martin Bonjour. And fucking tell me fuck off upstairs so you can impress that piece of shit. I must not mean fucking shit to you, Jamie, so you can press some fucking cocksucker on the internet. How the fuck did you do that to me? I didn't hang up tonight. No, you didn't. You told me fuck off upstairs. Don't press some fucking piece of shit on the internet. Did he get a good fucking laugh out of that? Are you crying? The fuck's the matter to you? You don't care. As long as you fucking spend time with Cunhole Jeffrey. Chef boy, our little fucking bitch. What? What? Fuck your fucking Chef boy, our bitch. Tell that fucking cocksucker, leave you the fuck alone. He's not. Stop that spending that. hours. So spinning out, he's not little, huh? So you know you've seen him. Oh, what can, Jamie? Fuck you. Go to spend your fucking time on working with that cocksucker. You know, any other fucking cocksucker. I'm fucking tired of your bullshit of having to fucking spend time on the goddamn internet with, with all these motherfuckers and you don't want to spend time with me. Fuck you. Why are you yelling? What? I'm taking up your time, Jamie. I'm taking up your precious time that you can be spending on the internet with these fucking pieces of shit. These people that mean so much to you. Are you willing to sacrifice me and you to spend time with these motherfuckers? And look at them on webcam. Oh, Jeffrey's not big. He's not little. How the fuck do you think I care? We made sausage you... together. Why wouldn't I have seen him? Yo, yeah, well, what did you see, Jamie? Did you see him? Just him? Or did you see anything else? Like what? How much of him did you see? What? How much of him did you see? You fucking right I want an answer after the bullshit you've been doing? I saw his cute dogs. You know, oh, fuck this. Fuck this. You want that motherfucker and every other motherfucker on the internet, and you want to ignore the fuck out of me, you go right ahead. Tell me when you want me and not them internet motherfuckers. Bye. Are you going to die? What? I'm talking to you right now, as if. Yo, know, you fucking ignore me all day, Jamie! What are you going to understand about that? For this fucking cocksucker on the internet! Not a fucking word to me, but you sure spent hours with that motherfucker! And then you got fucking lucky! You saw him on cam! And he probably saw you! How fucking great, Jamie! That just thrills me right to fuck! Then you fucking repeat his stupid fucking phrase, fuck off upstairs to impress him. Yeah, that's showing a lot of fucking feelings for me. Relax.
Max Bro. I'm not your bro! What? You gotta say something. You got me on fucking mic? You got me on mic so fucking tap freak in here? Are you naked? It don't fucking matter, Jamie. I ain't doing a goddamn thing right now. That's a yes. Long. What? Go get a condom. No, no, Jamie, no. I just know right now, but fuck no. Why not? You spent all fucking night ignoring me for that piece of shit. You think I'm fucking stupid in this bullshit? You'll be smoking fucking crack. You think I'm stupid in that shit? You are very stupid. No, I'm not, Jamie. I'm not the one on the fucking internet trying to impress other guys telling your fucking significant other to fuck off upstairs. I'm confused. I'm talking to you right now. Yeah, who'd you spend hours with today, Jamie? Because you certainly didn't fucking even text me. You probably didn't even read anything I texted you. We and you probably, you never, you, you probably never fucking listened to your voicemail either. We in together. Who's my significant other? I am, Jamie. We are together. Since when? We were never really apart. We've never wanted to be apart. You broke up with me. Yeah, and I didn't try to get back together with you. You keep telling me no. It's probably because of this fucking tunnel. It's teaching you all about fucking handling sausage. We're supposed to be working toward a relationship. Yeah, well, what the fuck are you going to work into a relationship with Catherine? Because you're spending more time with him than you are with me. You broke up with me and that hurt my feelings. Jamie, you don't think what you did hurt me? It I fucking killed me, Jamie. People. You talk to me. Jamie, you look at this motherfucker on cam. You tell me he no, he's no little. Like I give a fine rat's ass. The cocksucker gets to see you on cam. I'm sure you turned it on. You don't seem hurt. You seem like a child not getting their way. I'm fucking pissed, Jamie, because you ignore me to fucking spend hours with them. Two hours. Two hours. And how many messages have you sent me during the day today, Jamie? Two fucking hours you spent with this cocksucker. Two hours you spent with this cocksucker. For what reason, Jamie? Then you get me on mic on them. This morning. This morning up till 4.30, my time, and you didn't go to bed till 5.30. Who was that time spent with, Jamie? Who was that time spent with, Jamie? Two fucking hours. Is that today? Jamie, Is I said today, today during the... I said during the day. Is that today? Don't try to get around it. Is that today? Don't try to get around it, Jamie. When you woke up, how many messages did you send me? I've never yelled at an ex like this. Jamie, I've never fucking treated you like that. I've never fucking ignored you to talk to some piece of shit.
Hello. I'm here. Are you crying? It don't fucking matter, Jamie. What the fuck does it matter? You want to spend time with this cocksucker? You go right ahead. Why are you crying? I'm not... I'm not sticking around for you to spend time with fucking other guys like that. Why are you crying? Why do you think? Lord. What? Go get a condom. No. Why not? Jamie, you fucking ignore me all day. Just then spend time, yeah, two better. hours. And spend two hours with some fucking guy from the internet. It's really showing me love. It's really showing me love, Jamie. I'm going to guess this this whole time you fucking spent with him on the internet, he had his webcam on too, didn't he? He had his on and you had yours on. So you could fucking look at each other. You are the one who sounds like a boy or bitch right now. No, you got you got your fucking boy or bitch on the internet. You ignore me all, in the, all during the fucking day. Don't send me a fucking message. So you spent two hours staring at him on the fucking webcam and he can stare at you. Well, two hours. You told me you spent two hours with him. How many hours have yeah, I spent with you, Lord? Today, during the day, not a fucking message. Not including this morning, Jamie. Talking about when you woke up. Did I say today? When you woke up. Did I say today? When you woke up. Did I say today? Not a... When you woke up. How many hours have I spent with you, Lord? When, Jamie? When? Did I say today? Okay, well, what day are you talking about? Total. So, so that makes up for, for now, Jamie? What the fuck? You spent so many hours with me that you've just got to spend two hours with this fucking guy and ignore me. The one that wants to fucking marry you, Jamie. The one that's buying you a fucking ring. You gotta ignore me to spend fucking two hours with this cocksucker. From the internet. Fuck your ring. Do you not see the fucking problem? Your face is buried right in that fucking internet all the time now. I called four or five times to you. You still don't have a little phone yet. Because you're on the fucking internet. It's too bad you was did the whole night hanging up like a baby. But, Jamie, it didn't matter. You used to call me fucking back. When you hang up, I call you back. But instead, you fucking spend the time on that internet. I'm not playing that Because that, that internet, anymore. that internet has become so important to you. Grow up. Yeah, grow the fuck up. I'm not playing that game anymore. Well, get the fuck away from the internet then. You all make fucking friends fine. Don't fucking spend hours with them. High schoolers who are the playing the hang-up-and-chase game. Grow up. Who the fuck are these people to you? High schoolers play the hang-up-and-chase game. Grow up. Then stop hanging up on me, too. I didn't hang up once tonight, dummy. Tell me how you can put this chef boy, our cocksucker, before the guy that wants to marry you. Deflection. Before the guy that's buying you a ring. How can you put him before me? How many minutes am I allowed to talk to friends, Dad? Jamie, I don't give a fuck if you spend time with him for two hours a fucking day when you ignore me. 
You're ignoring me to spend time with these cocksuckers. And it takes you so long to answer the phone because you're on the fucking internet spending time with these cocksuckers. Spend two hours with someone. What is an acceptable amount of time? Why would you want to spend two hours with him, Jamie? Why do you? Two hours with someone. What is an acceptable well, amount of time? Why would you want to spend two hours with him? Why do you want to get to him? Why do you want to get to know him that well? Why do you want to get? Why is it just him you're spending time with? What is an acceptable amount of time? Why are you wanting to get to know him? Ten fucking minutes. Say fucking hi and bye. That motherfucker don't need to know anything about your life. He's from the internet. Or for that matter, how many minutes if I'm allowed to do whatever the fuck I want without you screaming like a psychopath? Jamie, my problem is you fucking ignore me to spend time with these people on the internet. I send you a text. You don't send me a text. No fucking hell, I'm uh, fine. She's, she's probably busy doing something. Well, no, 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 you're fucking on the internet spending hours with other guys. This morning, Jamie, not when you woke up, you didn't. I did text you today. Not when you woke up. Was it today? Don't try to get technical on Was that. It today? How many hours did you go without texting me today? How many hours did you go without? How many hours did you go without texting me? From four thirty this morning up to almost fucking nine thirty tonight. Case closed. And how I sold the case. It was today. That's because you don't want to hear what I said. But how many hours did you spend with? How many hours did you spend with Jeffrey? The Italian sausage making cocksucker. Two, I said that already. Yeah. Okay. So from four thirty to nine o'clock. What? Do you listen? All right, listen, but do you? I've, I've fucking told you this shit it's before, the Jamie. Answer is no. The answer is no to what? You don't listen. Jamie, I listen, but you don't listen either. You say that I don't listen, you don't listen either. I, I told you a long... You I told you a long time ago. You said... Yeah. I said two hours. Did you ever, Why did you ask me how long? You spent two hours with him, and you said you spent two hours with him and zero time with me. Oh, it's a competition. Seriously, Jamie? Ignored me to spend time with him. I'm talking to you now, dummy. You ignored me today to spend time with him. I didn't. Seriously? I didn't, I, I didn't see any return messages. I didn't see any return messages. I didn't see any return messages today, I Jamie. To today. The, no, don't play that bullshit. When you woke up, you spent two hours with him and not a message to Did me. I text you today? Don't try to get technical like that. Go I from did. the time that you woke up. Go from the time that you woke up, Jamie. Did you even read any of my text today? That's not how times works. No. What, what you're saying is not how it works. That's not how time works. You still had two hours after you and I were done talking that you were still awake. And I had sent you messages. You still didn't respond to us. I don't, I don't know who the fuck the you spent time with. What? Did the calendar say the 17th? Jamie, that's not the point. You know it. 
You just trying to, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, from the time that you woke up, from the time that you woke up today, from the time that you woke up today, you spent two hours with Jeff Free and not a message to me. Ignore me completely to spend time with him. Did you see Jeffrey on webcam today? Yeah. Did Jeffrey see? Yeah. Did Jeffrey see you on webcam today? No. No? Why did you have to see him? I didn't. So why was his webcam on? He turned it on. So you don't know how to click it off? Hey, detective. Why is this over? Why I am, have a date with who, MJ. Why, no, why is he fucking uh, sending you his webcam anyway? Why does he think that you hey, need detective. to see him? When's this over? I have a date with MJ. Jamie, I don't care if we've been fighting tonight or not. I want to fucking marry you. The golden pussy is calling me. Jamie, I don't care if we've been fighting or not. I want to fucking marry you. Will you marry me? No. You need to be fucking saying yes pretty soon. No. You got me all fucking unkinded because there's... Jeffrey, and you saying no to me. No. Everybody is a fucking threat to me right now, Jamie. No. Yeah, they are. That's not my problem. Yeah, it is. No. You're the one ignoring me to spend time with them. Me, that's fucking horse shit. It's your problem you feel threatened. You're the one that's doing it, Jamie. You ignoring me to spend two hours with another guy? That makes me feel threatened. That's a you problem, not a me problem. No, that's a me and you problem because you ignore me. To spend time with this guy. I'm not doing anything. Ex boyfriends shouldn't care. Um, I'm not ex either. Stop calling me ex. We're together. You are. No, I'm not. You broke up with me. And you I. Are. Well, I'm unbreaking up with you. I never wanted to be broken up. I never wanted to be broken. Stop. I never wanted to be broken up with you to begin with. I've always wanted to fucking marry you. Even when you called it off, it, it fucking hurt me. It's not, Jamie, but you keep fucking hurting me with shit that you do. That's a you problem. It's not a me problem. It's you're not paying attention problem. You're paying more That's attention to these problem. people on the internet. You're paying more That's attention to these problem. people on the internet than... Jamie, you're paying more attention to these people on the internet than you are me. That's a you problem. No, that's not. When you're saying, when you're saying... When you're saying fuck off upstairs so that you can, and you have me on mic when you say it, to impress this fucking cocksucker? Assumptions. Yeah, assumptions, because you never would have said it any other way. You made damn sure that I was paying attention when you said it. A a saying, a saying from another guy. Lawns change. That you spent two hours with today and ignore me 
so that you could spend two hours with him. Whatever, bro. You're the one that fucking does that shit, not me. My attention's on us. See, that's the stupidest fucking saying I have ever fucking heard. <laughs> that's funny, I think the same on good and you. Uh, you know, the funny thing is good and you can go Not with anything. Stupid. Uh, good and you? Stupid. Yeah, but the funny thing is, good and you can go with anything. Fuck off it's upstairs, can. Fuck off upstairs, cannot go with everything. Yes, it can. Oh, really? Is that because it comes from Jeffrey? Are you starting to see the fucking problem, Jamie? You just stuck up for him to me. Thanks a lot. There's no us long. Jamie. You broke up with me. I don't want to be broken up with you. Ah, no, fuck off upstairs. I'm so fucking tired of hearing that. I'm getting off the fucking phone. That's fucking horrible. That's fucking horrible. Now fuck off upstairs and get a condom. Hello. Thought we were done hanging up, pussy. I was I wasn't gonna call you back. You fucking. Okay, bye. I'm beside myself because you. Thought you weren't calling back. I wasn't going to. I can't understand why you're sticking up for this guy. It fucking hurts me. That's why I don't understand why you want. See, there you go again. No, I'm not dealing with that bullshit. You said that because you knew it would make me hang up. Maybe you wanted me to hang up so you could spend more time with him. You even stuck off for him to hurt me. I love you. Those cocksuckers on the internet don't. Why would you neglect me for them? Good night. You hung up. You want him. Oh, grow up, you child. I'm not the one ignoring you to spend hours with someone from the internet. Think about that and let that sink in. Then maybe you'll understand the way I feel right now. Did I talk to you today? Doesn't sound like ignored to me. You should grow up. Jamie, I never put you second to anyone, especially anyone from the internet. You say I should grow up, and I say you should pay attention to what's important to you. Who in this case was you stuck up for him to me? Is he really that important to you to hurt me? You can't get on the internet. Was I on the phone with you? Sure was. Grow up. How much time did you spend staring at him compared to the time you spent with me on the phone? Pay attention. You hung up. I had to. No, you didn't. I didn't want time with Jeffrey and his fuck off upstairs bullshit. But that's what I was getting. I wanted time with the woman I love. And I wasn't getting that. So yes, I had to hang up. You didn't. You didn't have to act like you were his girlfriend and stick up for him or repeat his retarded saying, but you did, so yes, I had to hang up. No, you didn't. You wanted me to hang around and feel like I was talking to his girlfriend instead of the woman I love? No, I had to hang up. No, you didn't. You didn't have to act like you were his girlfriend, but you did. Right. Saying a sentence makes someone act like they are with someone. Grow the fuck up. Better yet, fuck off upstairs. Pay attention. Fuck. Off. Upstairs. Staring at another guy on webcam for two hours is a long time. Keep living in your fantasy land. I'm going to go enjoy myself.
Want me to stop acting like this? Stop putting me before the internet and those online freaks. Busy. Fuck off upstairs. Yeah, you must be talking to your fucking Jeffrey again. Way to make things better with us, Jamie. Good job. It's obvious that we are no longer a priority to you. That internet is, though. I'm busy right now. You had your chance today. Oh, I know. The rest of your day is safe for your new love and priority, Jeffrey. Enjoy yourself. I won't be put second to internet freak. The preceding announcement has been paid for by the Lawn World Order.